In this video, I'll show you how to create a redirect and why to create a redirect. So, for example, we have this article called Sustainable Development Goals and Australia. Now, imagine if somebody doesn't know this article exists like that and they type into the search field SDGs and well, it says here and Iran, but it doesn't say and Australia, so I'll put in and Australia. So let's assume somebody searches like that and they hit enter and nothing really comes up, but you can change that and it's extremely easy. All you have to do is you click on this red link here. A red link means the article doesn't exist yet. You click on it and we don't really want to create a new article. We just want to create a redirect. And oops, for that I use the source editor because I'm adding here a particular command. And this command looks like this redirect, two square brackets, sorry, square brackets. Now I put the actual title. Okay, two square brackets. So it's a hashtag, redirect, and then the name of the article and I go publish page and I create this page. Now remember, you can only create articles if you've been an auto-confirmed editor, which means at least four days and 10 edits you must have made. So I've created this redirect page. So that means in future, if somebody types in SDGs and Australia, Ah, see, I've put Australia as this with a small a. So I'm just going to make a redirect for this as well. So that different variations all lead to the same thing. Okay, publish page, publish. So. Let's see if it works. SDGs and Australia. And I get sent to the right article. And you see here at the top, it says redirected from SDGs and Australia. So you'll see that it happens very often when there's something with a similar title and somebody else would have created those alternative titles. So, um, I think it's a really useful tool to help people find what they're looking for.